The process of, of creating whisky is a very simple one. Creating the spirit is a short term process, maturing it is a longer process. So we begin with our first ingredient, which is our barley that we harvest from our fields. That barley then needs to be malted, uh, a process of just growing it so that you can break down certain parts of the barley to give you the ability to extract a sugar from it. Uh, that ability to extract a sugar gives us this uh, ability to make alcohol, to ferment the alcohol, at the, the sugars at the distillery. We then distill that in copper kettles that we call stills and we create a very strong spirit, a clear spirit that is not whiskey yet. That spirit then has to be aged within the oak barrels that we source from all around the world. Uh, we source from America, Spain, France, uh, so many different countries give us the opportunity to take their oak barrels that we then can transfer the spirit that we make in Scotland into them and this is then left to mature into the whisky that we know, recognise and love the taste of. There are no secret ingredients to whisky. Uh, there, there are three. They are set out as, a, as an act of parliament. There is a Scotch Whisky Act that dictates um, what you can and can't do. Uh, so there is the technical aspect, but there's also the craftsmanship. Uh, from distillery to distillery, you'll find that they have uh, men and women who have worked there in the production of whisky for 30, 40 years, you know, years and years of expertise. Uh, the maturation of spirit really uh, develops three things within the spirit that we create at the distillery. Uh, first of all, the most noticeable sign of change is colour. You go from creating a clear spirit, when you put it into the cask it will pick up some of the golden colour out of the wood. Uh, secondly, it will pick up flavour from the oak and there are a range of different flavours and characteristics depending on where we get the oak from and, and what has been in the wood prior to, that, to us using it. So a whole range and gamut of flavours can come from that process. Uh, you then have the angel share, which is the evaporation of spirit, and in particular alcohol from the wood, uh, that just escapes the cask and evaporates into the air around us. And if, if you come and visit a distillery, you can smell it in the air, the, the angel share that just lingers over the, the warehouses. And by losing this, by taking this angel share out of it, this natural evaporation from the cask, the, the spirit that remains is becoming smoother and smoother. It's mellowing over time. Creating spirit is relatively short. It can take uh, up to just five days. It's then the maturation that can take years to get the whiskey to the point where it's at perfection.